Hi everybody, Rebecca J. Ray here, and today I'm going to show you two jewelry boxes that I bought on Amazon to put my Tiffany & Co. collection in. I brought the Tiffany bag out so you could see the color and compare it to the jewelry boxes. The small one is a little bit more greenish, and um, yeah, it was too small, so I'm going to take all my jewelry out of this little cute box. Um, it's called Langria, and I'm going to put it in the new, larger Tiffany Blue jewelry box. Now, when I first saw this box, this um, Vlando box, I was like, uh-oh, this is like a true blue. This is definitely doesn't look like Tiffany at all. Um, but then when I peeled back the dust bag, I saw, okay, well, now we're pretty close. Like, it's basically like the Tiffany blue, only a little bit darker. I think this jewelry box would be perfect for somebody who has a Tiffany theme going on in their bedroom or they like Tiffany jewelry and they need a place to put it because they don't have an actual Tiffany jewelry box and they're not planning on buying one just like me. Um, cause if I have, if I have money to spend at the Tiffany store, I'll probably buy jewelry. Just, just saying like, I don't know if I'll ever, ever buy Tiffany jewelry box. Um, but yeah so here we go there's a squishy pad in there it's just like a super nice quality jewelry box i like how it has all the flashy metal detail it's really nice a lot of jewelry boxes they would just have a ribbon to keep the lid from falling back all the way but this is really classy looking I'm just checking out the lock, making sure that it works good, and it does. It's very tight hold and very secure feeling. Also, the key is pretty nice. I've had jewelry boxes before where they come with little cheap flimsy keys, and this key is just a very elegant, um, strong, beautiful key. This Blando jewelry box comes with a cloth, and I don't know if it's for polishing silver. I assume it's just for shining the fingerprints off of your jewelry, but I should have read that uh, before making the video, so. Probably you'll read it on the Amazon description if you're gonna buy one off of Amazon like I did. On the earring cards, they hold three earrings I mean three pairs of earrings and one necklace. Or I suppose you could do four pairs of earrings because the necklace slot, you could use that for earrings instead. So that's eight pairs of earrings altogether on the cards. This little Langria jewelry box, it only costs $10 on Amazon. Um, so if you're looking for a jewelry box, put locking jewelry box and then prices low to high and it's gonna pop up langria that's spelled l-a-n-g-r-i-a and the really cool large vlando one that's spelled v-l-a-n-d-o and this one was thirty dollars oh i'm sorry it was like 30 something 36 38 i'm not really sure i'd have to check but it was in the 30s, and it's definitely worth every penny. And for my subscribers, I have a really cool video coming up next. Um, I'm going to talk about how I get gold and silver for free. And actually, all the Tiffany jewelry that you just saw in this video, even the gold key, I got for free. And I am 100% legal like nothing is illegal and I will explain exactly how I do that on my next video and I'm gonna take you to the Tiffany store because I'm actually gonna make my first purchase at the Tiffany store and I'll do a bunch of really cool close-ups so yeah if you're not subscribed now is the time <laughs>